Welcome to What You See Before You Hear. I'm Matt. And I'm TD. This is the place where cover art matters. The most. Today we're going to be talking about Paul Wall's new album, Hall of Fame Hustler. Right. Yep. The, uh, we were actually able to announce the cover art a few days early, mm -hmm. since we're familiar with the person who designed and photographed the cover, Mike Frost. He's been doing covers, I think, now over 20 years. He's yes. based in Houston. So he's worked with uh, Paul Wall a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's dope to see the... Uh... Uh, the the reference yeah for this yeah that's uh, the coolest thing yeah Akira is yeah, yeah Akira, Akira. it's a 1988 film it's like yeah. an anime film mm -hmm. it's, it's like um, post apocalypse it actually set in 2019 that's mm -hmm. the date so it's crazy we've caught up with that movie yeah technically yeah, so uh, it's a, in pop culture it's very popular it's very I've actually never seen the film Me I got put it on my to do list yeah I've seen many references I've Thanks. seen it all over the place so this is definitely something everyone should know about yeah it reminds me of uh when i look at it i thought the first thing i thought of like speed racer I was yeah like, i was like okay i get with the vibe yeah. of what a, you know where it come from he did very good with the execution yeah. like like the placement of it it's on point to where you can tell the reference already the car they mm -hmm. chose yeah that was very dope especially with like the culture of houston with the slabs yeah and all that you know so that that was definitely cool he even has on his uh back of his jacket he got uh is it oiler mob mm -hmm. it's like his um his merchandise yeah yeah so that's cool and um we was able to hear from mike frost um we'll put up what he said he was just talking about the influence of how akira influenced him so yeah because i was just about to say that like paul Wall must be tapped in yeah he must be too, <laughs> yeah that's what i'm saying like to to be and it's like you said it's, it's a part of pop culture so you know, to be a fan of music, you kind of want to tap into yeah. that part. You just kind of, you know, do your history. Do your I think that's going to that's gonna bring a lot of people that wasn't interested in his music to listen to the project. Like, this is a cover. If I'm scrolling, I really am going to click on it. Yeah. Like, I really am. And I'm like, Paul Wall, what? That's exactly. Era. And then if you even listening to the track, like, listen to the tape, it sounds up to date. Like, yeah. I, I think of, like, when you listen to a lot of old rappers, like, early 2000s, and they come out with music, it kind of still give you that old 2000s feel. Yeah. But this right here is like, it's still, it's Houston as hell. Yeah. His production is good. Yeah, yeah. I hear you and, on that. The and, production But surprising. it sounds like up to date. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah so it's fine. I yeah. like the first track. It was like, High As Me. I like that. Yeah. I like how that came in. My favorite song is actually Good Business. Yeah. I feel like that could actually be like, it could go up on TikTok or something like that. Yeah. So I really like that song. That's still sipping hard. Like oh, that. yeah, that was him dope. And, him and Lil' Kiki. Yeah. And, um, that was the lead single. Yeah, that was hard. Lil' Kiki. 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 Yeah, Lil' Kiki and, um, um, what's his name? Slim Thug. Slim Thug. Thug. Yep, yeah, that's what it was. that was cool. Yeah. I want to know if that was like, if he was just trying to go for like the still tipping, but more so like, it had to. This, this, yeah, you know, modern like, version of When Slim. I went to the album, I was like, damn, like, I gotta play that song. That's like the yeah. first one because I was like, still tipping, still sipping. For Let me real. see what you're talking about. So, yeah, had to tap mm -hmm. in with that one. Well, yeah, definitely some player music. Yeah, I'd say is. some player music and some good stuff to ride to, mm -hmm. too. So, that's definitely dope. Most definitely, man. So, y'all make sure y'all like, subscribe. Um, let us know what y'all think about the cover. Y'all like the reference of it. Um, what y'all did don't like about it. What y'all do like about it. And don't forget to uh, follow our IG page and what you see before you hear. And we out.